Hi there, thank you so much for your interest in my virtual classroom. In this video, I will explain a little bit about the product and also explain to you how you can easily customize the product to fit your classroom needs. So starting off, this is a Google Slides presentation. So when you purchase the product, it will be added to your Google Drive and you will open it from your Google Drive. You will notice that the background of this Google Slides presentation is not able to be edited. So if you try to move things around or delete them, that's not possible. But you are able to edit the green dots. And what the green dots are, are the activities that I have linked for students to complete. So when students open up this Google Slides presentation, all they'll need to do is just simply click on the green dots and it will take them to a link that they can follow to listen to songs, to listen to stories, or to play educational games. Now, I understand that um, you might not actually prefer to use some of the activities that I have linked. Maybe you have your own activities that you would prefer to use, or maybe you'd like to start off with my activities, and then as the year progresses, you'd like to change those out. So there is a way to do that, which I'm going to explain to you right now. But the first thing that you have to do in order to edit those green dots is you have to make a copy. You will not be able to edit the green dots on the initial copy that is added to your Google Drive. You have to make an additional personal copy of this product. So the way that we do that is we go up to File, Make a Copy, and Entire Presentation. Go ahead and click that, and then click OK. It will automatically open up your own personal copy of the product. And then in this copy, you will be able to edit those green dots. So the way that we do that is we just go right to the green dot and click it. And you will see that my old link will still pop up. In order to change it, you will just need to go up to the top right hand corner, find the icon that looks like a pencil. It says edit link. Go ahead and click that my link will still be in the box so you'll need to press the backspace key to erase it and then you're just going to right click and paste your own link then click apply and your link will automatically be added to the green dot and mine will be erased so your students will be able to click on your link and go to the website or the video or the song that you have decided to provide for them. So I hope that, that this video gave you a little bit more information about the product and I hope that it was helpful in explaining how you can edit those green dots to fit your own classroom needs. Thank you so much.